Hey guys, Holly here, and today I'm going to do a quick update on Zuzu's babies. These guys are four weeks old tomorrow, and they are precious. They are some of the sweetest and cutest babies ever. I'm loving them to death. Um, there's three of them. She did have five in her litter, but two of them were peanuts, and they passed away um, when they were just a couple days old. But these guys are doing so great. There's two boys and a little girl and I'm hoping to do a video on how to tell the genders apart at this age um, because I'm positive right now what their genders are and so I hope I can help you guys with that in a future video and this is little Finn my brother named him from one of the characters in the new Star Wars movie and then up here we have Prince Charming he's the little chinchilla and then our only little girl is Miss Heidi right here, and she's kind of napping. And they're just precious. Heidi is definitely the biggest, um, and that's one of the ways that I can tell her and Finn apart. She's just a lot bigger, and she has longer ears and a little bit of a longer face. And then his face is very round, and his ears are very short. Hi, Finny. They are just the cutest babies. Let me get them down so you can just see them hop around, because it's the cutest thing. Hello, Prince. Come on, Heidi. She's definitely the big girl. She's the first one to get up the, on the nest box, and she would just kick it up there, like, all day. And the other boys, they were too small to get up there. It was really funny. And you can definitely see the size difference between these two, because Prince is the smallest, and... She's the biggest. And then Finn is kind of like right in between, right in the middle. And there, I mean, you can see the size difference. It's pretty, pretty big difference. And even between these two, you can see a big difference. He's a little skinnier and he's a lot fatter. But they're just precious babies. I am loving them so much. And Zuzu's been a great mommy. And I've had a lot of new subscribers ask what happened to her ear. And um, when she was a baby, like just been born her mom bit that ear off and her mom ate her dead babies um, she's not in my robotry anymore I sold her pretty soon after that but her mom ate her dead babies and Zuzu was very close to being dead she was um, really really cold and almost dead I thought she was dead at first but um, I was able to save her and I tried selling her for a while as a pet, but she was a really, really nervous doe when she was um, really young. Like when she was this age, she was just completely normal, but then around eight weeks, she just got really nervous because she was just, you know, she's very sensitive around her head and around um, that area of her ear especially. So she does need um, an owner that knows her you know, that knows her boundaries and knows um, what she needs and how she likes to be pet and played with and that kind of stuff. So she's, I kept her because um, I just couldn't find an owner good enough for her. And I'm really glad that I did because I, I'm so happy with her babies. And their daddy is Mr. Ty down here. He's eating dinner. He's an opal. And mom is, um a chestnut and then Heidi and Finn are chestnuts like the mommy and Mr. Prince right here is a chinchilla and he's a gorgeous color this is one of my favorite colors oh Finny just jumped right up there they're so cute I am gonna be taking their nest box out soon I was gonna flip it about a week ago but um, once I found out that they could get in and out on their own and they were actually going on top of it then I just um, didn't worry about flipping it. So I'll probably be taking it out this week though, because they like they never go in it anymore. They just go on top of it for fun sometimes. But it's getting really warm out here now. Um, it's supposed to be like 85 degrees on Friday, so they really they don't need it at all. It would probably actually keep the cage cooler if it was out. So I'll be taking it out, and then um, I bred Wicket to May and a butterfly and I'll show you them in a minute um, I did that yesterday so hopefully we have new babies around June 9th um, which I'm so excited for here's May up here she's also 
eating dinner. She's a big blue doe. And she's very, very pretty. Hi, Maybelline. Soon I'm hoping to do a rabbit tree tour video and show you guys like all the bunnies and talk about them and answer your questions about them and stuff. Um, and so if you guys have any questions about any individual rabbit, um, be sure to leave those in the comments below and I'll answer those in my rabbit tree tour. I think that would be a really fun idea. Um, and so that'll be coming up probably next week. These babies are being pretty crazy. Hello Heidi. She's such a cute little girl. These boys are just the sweetest though. They just love to lick and give kisses. It's so cute. They're just precious. Here is Miss Butterfly and she's also hopefully pregnant. Um, and yeah, due on June 9th. And she um, she's had one litter before and that gave me Clementine. Um, and I can show you guys her too if you're a new subscriber. And this is Clementine. She's a beautiful orange color. I just, oh, I love her so much. And she has the sweetest personality. And she is also, um, she's Butterfly's baby, and her dad is also Wicket. And so that's um, who I bred Butterfly to this time as well. So we should get some more cute babies like Clementine. And I'm really excited about that because I just love her coloring. It's a beautiful, bright orange. Here's Mr. Wicket, and he is just the cutest thing. He's in a hutch um, because he sprays like crazy, like you can see um, on, on the back. All that white stuff is... From him spraying, hey buddy, usually he has a box in here, but I just took it out because it was getting all dirty and needs a new one. Hey buddy. And I try to get him outside to play in the yard like every day because he just has so much energy. And he just, I mean, yeah, he's a very, very active buck. And he, he loves playing in the yard. He tries to dig holes and stuff. He's a Super, super cute. Very silly boy. Hi, Wicket. He's really cute. He's my only buck that sprays, though. Like, I've never had any other buck come out of my rabbit tree that sprays, and he's the only one. And it's really upsetting. But he's he makes cute babies, so we keep him around. And he's a cutie himself, too. Alright, guys. That's about all for this video. Um, I did have my show last Saturday. And I did really, really well. Butterfly did amazing. Um, and if you guys want to hear exactly what I won at the show and how I did, um, you can see my social medias in the description box below, Facebook and Instagram. That's where I shared um, my results. And then also, if you guys don't have those social medias, I'll link um, a blog post that I wrote about it on my website in the um, description box below as well. So you guys can go read that blog if you don't have Facebook or Instagram um, to see exactly how I did. It was a really, really fun show. I wanted to take a vlog of it, but I just like completely forgot because we got there a little bit late and there was just so much um, back and forth and it was a really, really busy day. But I hope my next show is in July and I definitely want to get a vlog of that one for you guys and show you all... Um, what I do at bunny shows. They are being really crazy today. And so if you guys loved the babies and you thought they were so cute, be sure to give this a thumbs up. And I'll see you guys all in my next video. Bye and thanks for watching.